women are butterflies and men are gardens. If you're a garden and you grow your own flowers, the mm. butterflies will all come to you. Because exactly. we had so many questions and Naomi is about, oh, how can I get this girl? How yeah. can I talk to this girl? Too many of those. You do this thing first. Yes. Oh my God, yeah. guys, you'll be a beast. Exactly. Konnichiwa, good afternoon. What's up? It's Rupa Sensei here. And I have a great present for you guys today. Nick Nissan is back on the channel. Back with a vengeance. How you doing, brother? How you doing, buddy? Fantastic, you man. Good? Let me okay, get some of that. Big old okay, shake. Yeah. Big old shake here. So, people, you guys loved the last video, and you also gave us some great questions in the comments and everything like that. But before that, for people who have seen you for the first time, can you just do a little quick self introduction? Okay, yeah. I'm an American. I'm an American. I do manzai, I do some English stuff, I do some YouTube stuff. Yeah. I'm a jack of all trades and a master of all. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> That's very yeah. rare. Jack very of rare. all trades and a master <laughs> and of all. And a master of all. Yeah. Fantastic. How long have you been in Japan? I've been in Japan 15 years. Two more in guys there. Oh. Kick on the guys. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Very long. Very long. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Mm. And last time we talked about all the language learning. Yeah. How you learn Japanese. All the tips for learning English. So definitely go check out that video too. That was part one. This is part two. Part two, okay. Now we're gonna do some Naomi Sodan. Sounds and good. Some little uh, advice for all the questions that we got in there. Sounds good. But uh, Nick, how you been, man? You Dude, I'm good? always good. You doing good? Even when I'm not good, I always say I'm good. There we go. That's what you gotta do. How do you stay so positive all the time? You don't have to be positive, just pretend yeah. you are. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, angry, angry, sort of. Like, I hate it when I'm like, hey man, how are you doing? Mm. I just want them to say good. I don't want them to be like, well, I had a cold last week. Yeah. I'm like, no, 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 just say good. It, you know yeah, what I mean? yeah, yeah, yeah. It relates back to that proverb, misery breeds company. Yeah. Look around your friend group right now. If they're all miserable people, negative people, man, chances are, if, if you got friends like Nick, big grouper over here, positive people, that's gonna bleed off into your life. Yeah, another become... thing they say in the, the army and the navy, and mm. this is a little bit strong, but they okay. say suffer in silence. Ooh. So you you could suffer yourself, but when you're with the other people, you don't make them suffer with you. Yeah. And that's important, like if you're in war or something like that, Yeah. and you're afraid, if you make everybody else afraid, you guys might all die or something like yeah. that. So they say suffer in silence. Exactly. Which is, you know, you could take that, you know, sometimes you do need to talk to somebody, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But. A lot of the time, when we're feeling bad, you don't need to tell anybody. Yeah, and guys, here's the truth. A lot of the time, people don't really care about if you just got small problems, because we all know people that they, every time you meet them, they got a new problem. I'm like, buddy, there's probably yeah. a bigger underlying problem of it all. And I would say it's yeah. not they don't care. Some people will be happy that you have those problems. Yeah, you that's know? exactly. Yeah, so yeah. it's either they don't care or they're happy that you're not happy. Yeah, yeah. and that's when you need a little friend group. Yes, yes, yeah. exactly, exactly. How do you find good friends? How, that's a very hard thing. Yeah. And one skill I've always had in my life is that I've always been able to find good friends. Really? Yeah. How do you do it? You got to be selective. Okay. You can't just be anybody's friend, right? Mm. And you, if you want to find good friends, you have to become the best version of yourself too or nobody is going to want to hang out with you. Yeah. And you got to be willing to throw away your ego. Like, mm. I hang out with Rupa. I hang out with the Eikawa heroes. They all have more followers than me. They've been doing Insta longer. But you want to hang out with people that, you know, are above Push you. you. Exactly. Yeah, so you can yeah. learn from them. That's why all the Japanese comedians have the senpai kohai and why all the kohai are always with the senpai. Because yeah. they learn from the senpai. It's you know? actually, I actually really like that part about Japanese culture. Yeah. Kohai senpai. Yeah. Because they've been through it all. Learn from them. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And that's great what you said there. Work on yourself first. Like winners hang around other winners. Yeah. If you're on your mission, you're going in the gym, you're working hard on whatever you're doing, your mission, other people will be like, oh man. I don't care if he's a singer, I don't care if he's a basketball player, exactly. I don't care if he's a YouTuber or a manzai, or, yeah. I want to be around him. Exactly. Because that exactly. energy is all the same. Yep. Yeah. 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 Exactly, guys. I'll be in the gym and I mm. see a guy that looks like he can lift more than me. My best friend, I went up and talked to him five years ago. Yeah. We became friends like that. There you go. You got to go up to people. Now, that's another skill mm. that is very hard to do in Japan. Mm. And you have to be willing to be embarrassed and turned down. I get turned down all the time. Yeah. People might think you're creepy. People might, mm. you know, you can reduce that, you know. Yeah. But you need to put yourself out there. Mm. I mean, when I go out with Rupa, he's always, like, talking to people on the <laughs> hey, street. Hey, man, how you doing? <laughs> out of a, ten people, one person will be responsive. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the more you do it, the better you get. And then that... 
one in ten becomes fifty fifty. Yeah. Well, so like I'm studying Spanish now. Yeah. And on Saturday, two days ago,、mm. I saw two Mexican guys. I could hear them speaking Mexican Spanish.、Mm. I just talked with them, and then we ended up talking for like 15 minutes. You know, I didn't become their friends, but like you can create these opportunities. Most、yeah. people will want to talk to you if you, yeah, you know. Yeah, exactly. And that's so good for language learning. I used to do that same thing when I was learning Japanese, like at school back in Australia. Yeah. And I'd hear Japanese on the train, just you know, just some small talk. Yeah. That's gonna help you guys. Getting confidence, making new friends, and learning your language, learning English. And one thing I can tell you guys, we can do this more in depth next time.、Mm. You know I box. Yeah. I spar. So when you're boxing and getting hit in the face, there's nothing more scary than that. You're so nervous.、Mm. But I can tell you, even for me now, I'm more scared to approach strangers sometimes and talk to them, especially for guys talking to girls. Yeah. It's one of the most terrifying things you can do.、It's, you never get used to so it. So I'm <laughs> yeah. I'm saying I can get in the ring with a pro boxer and still not be as scared. That's yeah, how yeah, scary yeah. it is. That's so, it. That's it. You don't think about it. You just do it. Mmm. That's it. Just do it. Just do just it. Just do it. And I feel like the more you think about it, the more you're gonna become your own enemy、yeah. and be like, you're gonna think about the worst case scenario.、Yeah. There's a great principle: the three second rule. Yeah, I was just gonna say. Yeah. <laughs> you go in three seconds, even if you have nothing to say, even if you're going in like a kamikaze who's、mm. about to get shot down. Yeah. You still do it. Yeah, that's great. That's great. Do you have any opening lines that you would use for someone? If you guys are say Japanese and you want to talk to a foreigner in、mm. Japan, don't say "Do you speak English?" Maybe come up to them and、yeah. say in Japanese, "Simasen, Nihongo shabere masu ka?" or something、oh, like、yeah. that. You know, it doesn't matter. It, it, it matters how you convey yourself, how、yeah. relaxed you are. Yeah. If you, you know? say it in a confident manner, you look them in the eyes. You've got calm body language. You're not super tense up and、no. facing them straight on. You know, just relax a little bit. Calm down your voice. Exactly. You could be like, "Dude, I like your shoes. Yeah, those are some nice shoes. Where'd you get those?" Or if it's a cute girl, you'd be like, "I really like your style."、Mm -hmm. Just that.、Right. That's it. Yeah. And you can even talk about things in the environment. Okay. Do you know any good restaurants around、yeah. here? Oh, what kind of things do you eat? You know that that's a great opener as well to talk to random people. And if they ignore you or like look the other way, because I do this actually, I've been doing this every week. Yeah. It's a practice. Okay. I don't even want to make friends or do anything like that. I just、yeah. want to get good at like、yeah. talking to random people. You, I got turned down a hundred times, like maybe the first time I did it. Yeah. And I must tell you, I was a little bit depressed. Yeah. But what you got to do is you just go to the next one. Get over it. Yeah. Move get on. Over it. Yeah. Move we on. actually used to do the exact same thing when I was a salesman, because. Believe it or、exactly. not, group of sense. I used to be a bit more of a shy guy. Yeah. When I started sales, I had to get over that. And then my sales manager used to always take me out to bars and even just on the street, just go up to people, ask them what their favorite animal is. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, yeah. And if you're a confident guy, you've got your your good posture, you're relaxed, you got a calm voice. Look them in the eye. You can talk about anything with any. I'll, I'll tell、person. you one example of a really good opener that I、mm. said one time. I was in Ebisu.、Mm. And it was the day after it rained, and you know how there's like street rails, you yeah, know, like a rail on the street. There were like fifty umbrellas that people left on the rails, yeah, yeah. And there were two girls sitting in front of the umbrellas. Okay. And I was like,、um, I'll take that one and that one, please. <laughs> and you know, they started laughing, and then the conversation started. So you can just、yeah. like say stuff depending on the environment、mm. that you're in. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. And definitely use humor. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Everyone, everyone likes a laugh. Exactly. exactly. Everyone loves. Maybe laugh. more non-Japanese than Japanese because it's not、right. normal really to make jokes in Japan.、Mm. But yeah, yeah, you could do it. Exactly.、Sure. Exactly. All right. There we go. There we、okay. go. And that relates into one of our Nayamis. Yeah, so, dude. Guys, we sent a message out to all you guys and said, "What Nayamis do you had?" And one of them was. So in English, how to talk to your crush? How to talk to your crush? Yeah, so it's a scary thing. Maybe he's in school or something like that. Yeah. You know, when I was in school, I was pretty nervous. I would always have philosophy class, and there was this one cute girl there. You know,、mm. <laughs> she was smart and cute. I wanted to talk to her. You know, and I, I didn't know what to do at the time. You know, so it's great. You're very lucky, guys, to have a Nick、uh, Nissan. One Sen Rupa Sensei, Sensei here, Sensei right? Rupa Sensei here, right? Yeah. So just say you're in class or it's lunchtime and you're walking, and the, your crush is walking that way. Yeah. How would you approach her? Well, can I get into a more macro、mm. argument、mm. about this? Say you have till the first of next month, you have to make a basket in one shot. 
Okay. That's basically what talking to your crush is, right? Yeah. Are you going to wait till that one day and just take the one shot and hope mm. that you do it right? I don't think you're going to get it. I think you're going to get nervous. Yeah. I think you're going to mess up. Yeah. Because you haven't done it before. Mm. If you want to talk to your crush, you need to talk to like a hundred of your crushes, which <laughs> goes back to what we just said. You just talk to people all the time. Yeah. To where you get comfortable talking to anybody. Because mm. you shouldn't talk to your crush like, um, yeah. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. You you talk to them like you talk to your friend. You want to be super casual. Yeah, but yeah. To, to have self-confidence, you actually have to do the thing mm. a bunch of times. You can't just be confident and mm. have never done it. Yeah. To get confidence in basketball, you have to play basketball a lot. Exactly. So don't jump the gun. Start small, you know? You don't even have to start talking to your crushes. I used to just go out and just... To uh, grandma's sitting yeah, exactly. down the street. I just be like, oh, you ladies look beautiful today. Yeah, yeah. Have a great day. Puts a smile on their yeah, face. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then you walk off. Stuff like you know? that. Exactly. So yeah. there's no special way to talk to a crush. It's just mm. how you talk to your friend, to your yeah. other friends who are girls or friends who are guys. Yeah. It's when you start treating them in this weird special way where you get yes. psych yourself out yeah, and then you yeah, sound yeah. weird. Yeah. The worst thing you can do is think that she's like a princess exactly. and she's the only... Great, what great say, girl in the don't world. Don't put them on a pedestal is what we say. Yeah, there's many beautiful great girls out there, yeah. man. So why don't you practice talking one. to a hundred great girls out there before you talk to your crush? There you go, and then you're gonna be so much more confident, and then she's gonna be like, "Wow, this guy's kind of cool." There's no other way around this, by the way. Mm, exactly. That's the only way to do it. Yeah. And also work on having interesting stories to yeah. talk to her about, because you know after you talk with your crush. What are you gonna ask her out on a date? You're gonna go out on a date with her, then that's the next step. You gotta have interesting stories, jokes to make the date go well. Yep, yep, yeah, I mean, every day. Mm. Yeah, I mean, maybe write, have a journal or something like that, you know? What yeah, I mean? yeah, yeah, yeah. Write exactly. one interesting thing that happened during the day or one thing you learned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? And I guess the whole principle of what we're talking about is work on your skills and then get to a stage where your crush wants to talk to you. Exactly, you've heard it before. Women are butterflies and men are gardens. Have you heard this? Ooh. If you try and catch the butterfly with your hands, it's either going to get away or you're going to crush it and Ooh. it dies. If you're a garden and you grow your own flowers, the mm. butterflies will all come to you. Mm. So that's why women are butterflies and men are gardens. You have to grow your garden if you're a guy. Very wise philosophy right yeah. there. So grow your garden yeah. and then let the butterflies come. Then exactly. it's going to be more than one butterfly yeah, too. Exactly, you know what I mean? Exactly. And then, yeah, then you're set. You're set. Yeah. So, dude, do your best like that, man. Sounds Just good. keep going. Keep practicing and keep working on yourself. Next, Nayami Sodan. This is a weight training and a weight training. But the weight is very small and it's always hard to stop. So what is the weight? They get made fun of. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, that's not... Yeah, they get made fun of. Well, look at me. Yeah, look at me and Rupa. Look at how much taller Rupa Rupa is than me. Because I've always been short, and it's much worse to be short in America than it is to be in right. Japan. Right. Because everybody's huge. You can't mm. play sports. Mm. I always think about the amazing short people like Bruno Mars. Exactly. Tom Cruise. Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee, dude. It's how you present yourself. Yeah. You know what I mean? So I box with guys that are like shorter than me and way less than me, and they kick my butt. Yeah. Same as jujitsu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've you'll, been tied in like a pretzel by some really short. You'll do it with some guys. old guy. Yeah, I'll do it with yeah. like a seventy-year-old guy who's like a brown belt, and he'll destroy me. The height doesn't matter. That's the height only matters in your head, and when you let it matter in your head, everybody else is gonna think about it too. Mm. And more looking at it as a big picture, what do you do when someone makes fun of you though? Because he's saying that he's getting made fun of for his height. How yeah. do you respond for that? What you have to do is get really good and then beat them. Yeah. That's one way. Yeah. Don't even engage with those mm. type of taunts. Right? Yeah. Or you can do it with humor. You can make fun of yourself first. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Get really good and be like, I don't know if I want to fight you. I'm just this tiny little short guy. <laughs> and then when you fight them, then they see how strong you are. You know what I mean? Yeah. And looking at it more like in your daily life, don't let people bully you around, okay? No, 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 yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. I've got two rules. Don't bully people. Don't get bullied. Yeah. Okay. You got to stand you're up for yourself. responsible for both. Exactly. In this day and age, we like to like, you know, put hey, blame teacher, on... teacher, teacher, he bullied me. No. Dude, take it into your own hands, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That doesn't mean just like destroy the no, guy. No, but... no, no, no. There's a hundred ways you can do it, but... But, you know, bullies are like sharks when they smell the blood. Every mm. time you, you say teacher, teacher, or you 
you cower, that's mm. when your blood starts flowing and then the sharks start coming in because yeah. they can smell your blood. Yeah, you got to stand up for yourself. Yeah. But it's great that he's on the path of doing these weights. Yes, weights. exactly. Doing don't don't stop weight. that. That's exact. Just keep doing that. Yeah. So congrats to you, man. You're yeah. on, you've got your foot in the door. You're on a great start. Just keep doing that. And dude, like when you think of Tom Cruise, like you said, or Bruce Lee and stuff. Yeah, or Bruno Mars. Yeah. You don't even think of them as a short guy. You think of them as their great achievements. Exactly. And it's really funny because you know you'll see Bruno Mars with his girlfriend, who's like a foot taller than yeah. he is. Girls are in love with him, and I've never heard them talk about his height. Yeah. I never hear girls talk about Inoue, the boxer, the Japanese boxer's oh, yeah? height. It's tiny. Yeah. Everybody's just like, this guy's amazing. Yeah, he's a beast. Yeah, you can be a, a short nothing or a short something. If you're going to mm. be anything, you want to be a short something. That's what yeah. I try to do. Yeah, and there's going to our core stoic principles that we believe in is there's things you can control and there's things you can't control. Your height, you can't control it. Yep. It's something that was gifted to you. That's just your biology, man. But I, I'm not gonna lie. I do compare my, like I'll be like at the party. Like we mm. were at a party last night. There's this tall, G Jimmy, handsome Rupa yeah, Sensei yeah, or Jimmy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, man, I wish I was tall, but can't do anything about that. What else can I do? I speak Japanese good. Yeah. I'm handsome. <laughs> I'm there smart. And extremely humble. Yeah, <laughs> humble exactly, exactly. So. Very good, yeah. yeah. So focus on the things that you can control. You you weren't just like, oh, I'm a short guy, okay, whatever, man. I guess I'm just, no girl's gonna like me. Yeah, yeah, no. No, 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 you took your life into your own hands, yeah. worked on yourself, and you're the man you are yeah. today. Exactly, exactly, exactly. There we go. So keep going, man. Yeah. Just keep working yeah, on yeah, it. Yeah, keep doing that. Kakutogi, man. Should we do one more? Let's do one more. Wrap yeah, it let's up. Let's do one more. Right in there, this person is going he's going abroad. And Okay, great. Great mix. Yeah. Is there anything else you can do? Oh, that's a, that's a really good one. Yeah. Yeah, well, can I give my advice? Go for it. As you know, English is a communication. It's not, mm. it's not a book. Yeah. You know, it's sold in Japan as like it's a book or it's yeah. a test. Learn how to use that English you learned. So, exactly. as we talked about before, you go out and you talk to people in English. Learn how to communicate with people. This will help you with business. As you said, you know, marketing yep. or selling things. Mm. This will help with making friends or making connections. Yeah. We would never be, have been able to connect or with all the guys we know, all mm. the Eikawa heroes or all the other big Instagram or YouTubers mm. without the skill of communication. Exactly. If we were too scared to say, hey, let's collab or if, if we sounded weird or something like, learn, learn how to not sound weird. <laughs> I know it's a weird <laughs> thing uh, to say, but yeah, 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 yeah. it makes sense. And it's okay to have a Japanese accent. There's nothing wrong with that. Exactly. But just learn how to communicate. Yeah, look at like Ken Watanabe Yeah, in, like, Last man. Samurai. Yeah, dude. You know, like a lot of people will, you know, make fun of like an accent or something, but you know, stuff them, man, you yeah. know? You, you sound like a samurai, but if you've got the confidence, you've got the communication skills, people are like, oh, he's awesome, exactly. man. He sounds like a samurai, you know? Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So yeah, definitely focus on your communication skills because a lot of people, a lot of people actually, they're like ALTs and they'll come to Japan and they have a terrible time. Yeah. Because they don't even know how to communicate. They don't know the language. So good on you for working on those things. But yeah, really focus on your communication skills how to build friends. Yep. Keep up the gym and maybe look at some magazines for style. That's one mm. thing me and you have that a lot of guys yeah. don't have. Rupa Sensei has his own, you know, very dapper suit style with this shirt open, like a sexy man he is. Actually buttoned up extra oh, button today. Button, okay, extra button. And then I do the kind of, you know, vintage. Mm. Captain 1940s, America. 50s. Yeah, yeah, man. So, you know, have a look. That's what I tell all guys. In this day and age, if you ever want to get a cute girl or anything like that, you have to have a look. Yeah. Have a look. Have a look. And work on it. People see you and they're like, he's fresh. Yeah. Develop your style. And a great point that you're already doing is going to the gym because a great way to meet friends is through those hobbies yeah. like gym and boxing, jujitsu. Yeah, man. So keep doing it. If you're going to the gym every day and then you say you're in Australia and there's the same guy who's going at the same time as you, make friends. Also make another hobby. A lot of the time women bond through communication and men bond through doing things. Yeah. So... We bonded through doing like YouTube or stuff yeah. like that together. Uh, a lot of guys bond. We do bond through jujitsu. Yeah. So we don't just go to a cafe and talk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Go so, get our nails done. Yeah, so you, exactly. Yeah, so yeah, you yeah. make a tribe of guys that like, mm. or you do, you find a hobby. Start doing jujitsu. Start doing boxing. Yeah. Start doing something that you like that involves other people, not video games, because then you're in your house. Right. But you know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that'd be another thing. And if you're going abroad in school, man. 
you're going to be a king, you know? Yeah. Yay. I mean, if you do jujitsu jiu now in Japan, say, and you go to abroad, you're still going to find guys doing jujitsu. Or yeah. like, Ichiro from Japan, he does jujitsu too. I want to be his friend. Yeah. You know, fantastic, that fantastic. type of thing. And that's been like the core principle of all these Naomi's today. So to wrap up, Nick, what would be your number one advice just for people working on themselves? My number one advice for people working on themselves. I mm. mentioned earlier, but confidence is gained through actually doing things. Not, yeah. It's not a state of mind. Yeah. I'm confident in Japanese because I've been speaking it for 15 years. Yeah. Or I'm confident in going to the gym because I know how to work out because I worked out. Mm. So don't just think that you can have the confidence of something that you've never done before you actually have to do it yeah exactly to gain it and build it into a routine because then you're going to do it more exactly yeah, exactly exactly all right did you want to wrap up with anything else uh just remember the kakiku kekos golden rule kane ka kinniku ki uh kakiku daieto ni kyotsukeru kuimono ne ke kenka kenka suru n janakute kenka dekiri yo ni naru yeah, exactly. And just like you've said, all these things are about yourself. Exactly. Because exactly. we had so many questions and Naomi is about, oh, how can I get this girl? How yeah. can I talk to this girl? Too many of those. You do this thing first. Yes. Oh my God, yeah. guys, you'll be a beast. Exactly. You remember, yeah. you're the garden. Exactly. Man, right. Nick, thanks Dude. so much for coming on Thank today, so much, brother. That's nice. Dope. Part three. Part three <laughs> right. coming up soon. Sounds good. And guys, let us know if you have any more questions that you'd love to ask us. Naomi Soldans, put them down in the comments. We'll read all your comments and prepare them for lesson three. All right, man. And also check out Nick's Instagram. Twitter, YouTube. Twitter. Man, man. Yeah. Everything. We've got it all linked down below. Check it out, guys. All right. Smash that like button. Stay happy. Stay healthy. Do your best with your English studies. Ja arigato. Matikondo. Thanks again, brother. See you, man. Hey. Peace.